Hey YouTube, Ben the Bondsman here. I uh, recently got rid of some of my single purpose uh, VHF walkie talkies and uh, purchased a Bofang UV5R dual band radio and I just wanted to talk about some of the really cool features. Now I know that there's already a bunch of videos about this radio but this is my opinion man this is an awesome radio especially for the for the money um, and I, I would I would hold it up against the Woshangs and the Heights and TYTs and stuff like that for you know for the bang for your buck. This is a really cool radio. You know one of my <clears throat> one of my favorite features is is it's got dual monitor capability. Um, I'm monitoring here County Fire One and Share for Peters at the same time. Alright, and on top of that, I can listen I go. to my favorite FM station while it's monitoring these. And if somebody were to key up on one of these, it would momentarily interrupt that radio station, listen to them talk, and then when they were done talking, it would come back to the radio station. So that's actually a feature that I've been using quite a lot the last couple of days. Then it has this really neat uh, flashlight on the top of it that I've actually uh, used a few times. I've uh, used it quite a bit actually. But those are just a few of the cool features. The only gripe I really have about this radio is it is a pain in the neck to program by the keypad. It can be done, but there's the instruction book isn't very helpful. You have to actually go on YouTube and find instructional videos to learn how to do it. But when you get the cable and the software, which I was able to borrow somebody's today because mine hadn't come in yet, um, it is a breeze to program. I mean, it it's just as easy as you type it and it's in the radio. I programmed, I think, uh, 70 something channels and alpha tagged them so I wouldn't have to worry about remembering what channel is what. I can just look, say, oh, oh, County Fire 1, Sheriff, County Fire 2, and so on and so forth. So, this is a really great radio. And if you're in the market for um, secondary communications, this is definitely worth the money. It cost me about $65 and uh, it came with a charger and uh, belt clip. Now I don't put the belt clip on it and I'm going to show you why in a second. Um, part of my emergency bag is I keep one of these in there. Um, this is where I keep the charger for the radio. Now I, I need to get a 12 volt step down charger to that will go in the base for this. I talked to the uh, Woshan USA dealer today and he uh, indicated that they may not be uh, producing a double A AA or triple A pack for this radio because of its size. Um, but one really cool thing about its size is check that out. A waterproof the antenna goes right there impact resistant Pelican case. It fits in there perfectly. The Pelican 1010 case. It fits in there snug enough where it's not going to move around, but not so tight that I had to force it in. And the antenna fits perfectly in the lid. And there you have it. Perfect for an emergency bag or a bug out bag or get home bag or get kicked out of your house bag whatever you want to call it but uh anyway that's my little uh tidbit on the bofang ub5r uh let me know what you think